To assemble the rainbow roll, first you're going to go ahead, you're going to dunk that rice paper wrapper very briefly in water. Now we need to start with the micro shisho. We start with the ingredients that we want to be best displayed. We start with them farther away. So here I'm taking some watermelon radish, some candy striped beet, I'm just kind of arranging them. There's no really right or wrong way to do this, but just kind of arranging them in like a shingled pattern here. Next, I'm taking a pretty decent amount of the red cabbage, followed by some pickled carrot. Okay, and I'm almost stacking these ingredients, notice, okay? I'm pulling them a little bit towards me, but essentially they're stacked. Following that up with some mint, some Thai basil, and I'm gonna start here, and whoopsie, I forgot more cabbage. So add another handful of cabbage, Okay, and then we are going to roll this kind of like a burrito. Now, what I didn't do, but I should have done, dunk your fingertips in the water that you used for the rice paper. I didn't do that, and notice how my rice paper is getting a bit stuck on my fingers. Okay, so dunk that. Uh, the tighter you get this roll, the better. Okay, but these are supposed to be somewhat, um, somewhat rustic. Okay, now what I'm doing, again, getting a little bit stuck here, but I'm taking the bottom of my my rainbow roll, dunking it here in these black sesame seeds, and that will help me make sure that when I actually go to pick it up, I can do so. Okay, that's it.